YouTube, it's Weird Paul. It's mail day again, and today's package comes from subscriber Sonic More Music. So let's take a look at what I got. First of all, I got these. These Rolling Stones 3D glasses were for sale at convenience stores back in 1990, and you could use them to watch a special 3D broadcast from their Steel Wheels concert tour. That's rare. That concert broadcast is actually on YouTube, and I used these to watch some of it. Next, I got this vintage video freak pin. Ooh, how kinky. Then I got this Canada magnet, and it's also a thermometer. That is wild. Joe also sent me this classic movie that I'd never seen before, Valley Girl. So Niffer and I just watched it. Like, totally! We watched Valley Girl together last night, didn't we, Neffer? Uh, like, totally for sure. <laughs> what did you think? Ugh, gag me with a spoon. <laughs> yeah, like, I can't believe it was 1982, another 1982 movie. It says 83 on it, but on the actual, on the movie itself, yeah. it said 82, yeah. I was a little too young when it came out to see it, so I only had to wait how many years? Yeah, well, over 35 years. That was cool. I thought it was pretty entertaining. I didn't, I didn't really care for any of those valley people. I thought they were very boring. Yeah, they were like the soches. The soch, you know, the kind of pedestrian... Uh, but then, you know, you had Nicolas Cage and uh, his buddy there. They were the weirdos. Yeah, I like Nick Cage in this, even though I felt like he just, he really didn't do much. But I thought he was, I liked his character, though. I still liked him. Ditto. I thought that this was like, um, kind of maybe the blueprint, it seemed like, for all the John Hughes movies that came out later like in the 80s, like 16 Candles and Pretty in Pink and all that mm -hmm. kind of stuff. It reminded me a lot of those, although I think those are those are actually a little bit better than this. Yeah, more of the characters were fleshed out in that one, whereas this one seemed more like a, a morality play, which, which is fine, too. It gives you a real time capsule of what, what it was like to be a vow. Yeah, there was some pretty good music on the soundtrack, I have to say. Yeah, yeah. That was impressive. I couldn't believe there's so much sparks in there. You know I... what else I like? The old cash register. That old cash register they kept showing at the beginning. Oh, yeah. Like when you used to slide on the credit card thing and tick, 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 tick. Yeah, that was really the cool. In. The most thing I was the most disappointed about is that... I never saw Nicolas Cage wearing this in the movie. I never saw him like with the shirt, no shirt, and the vest, the tie. I didn't see him wearing that in there. Yeah, but he had a very nice chest rug. Yeah, that's, that's um, right. where he wore at the beach. It's such an iconic image that I've seen my whole life since this movie came out, even though I'd never seen the movie, that I couldn't wait to see him dressed like that, and I didn't see that in the movie. Can you do the Nicolas Cage look that he did in the movie all the time? Like this? But you have to, like, point your chin down. Oh, okay. I go. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard. Uh, eh, it's pretty funny. And here's something else that Niffer and I get to share. A box of the Canadian candy Scaries, a Halloween-themed version of Smarties. And there's 30 fun-sized packs in here. It's like hitting the jackpot. Damn! Damn! Scaries, ooh, how scary. From the makers of Smarties. I think this one is more appropriately named. These are little, they're little fun packs. See, here's one for you. Ooh, yeah. we got, oh, you use hands. And uh, you don't eat the whole box. I mean, you could eat the contents of the box, not the actual box. I don't want to read what's We've in We've got, this. yeah, don't. We've got uh, ingredients whole cover the entire back of the box. 30 packs of these in here. A little wedge is approaching. I, I have to say, when I was a kid, I loved little boxes like this. I like to save little boxes like this and put 
you know, like little charms or something in them. So there's orange ones and orange. there's brown ones. I like put it else. in my face. Mmm. These are. I don't think they. I don't think they're different flavor. No, it's just right here. I don't understand. Same original flavor as the Smarties that we had before. They're just Halloween colors, right? Brown it's, and orange. It's like <laughs> peanut butter plus perfume. <laughs> right? Yeah. Tastes like M&Ms. But no, they're more fragrant. Yeah. More flowery. And they, like I said in the other video, they don't melt as fast. I don't think. When you're, you put them in your mouth. You're just going to keep eating them and eating the them? The shells are. Eating them. The shells are like, um, they don't melt as fast as M&M's. Oh. Protective coating. Mm hmm That's scary. Want some more? You're trying to scare me. <laughs> I see it made me make a sound. I also got this oversized postcard of a 1970 photo of the downtown area of Arilla in Ontario, Canada. And Joe's son, Ben, sent me these. Six Pokemon cards. These are really cool ones. My favorite is this Japanese language execute card. <laughs> And finally, I got some trading cards. First of all, I got 10 1991 YOL MTV Raps cards. A couple feature one of my favorite rappers, Big Daddy Kane. And I got packs of 1987 ALF cards and 1983 A-Team cards, both from Topps, and a pack of 1981 Dukes of Hazard cards from Don Russ. This was one of my favorite shows as a kid, and I never had any of these third series cards before. <laughs> I like it. Speaking of things I never had before, I got a whole pack of 1990 Robocop 2 cards from Topps. I'd buy that for a dollar. <laughs> and finally, I got a 1988 Pee Wee's Playhouse Fun Pack. Let's open this up and check out what's inside. There's a sheet of tattoos, three trading cards, stickers, a wiggle toy featuring Terry, and an activity card with Miss Yvonne. It's dance time! Thanks so much to Joe at Sonic More Music for the trading cards, the candy, the Valley Girl DVD, and everything else. You rock, dude! Excellent! Be sure to check out the Sonic More Music YouTube channel for fun old TV clips. And definitely check out Joe's amazing music blog. The links are below in the description. I'll see you soon with more memories. Thanks, YouTube. Like, totally!